So I have my Jupyter Notebook open here. Let's see how we can install packages in Jupyter Notebook. So first, let me create a new notebook. So keep in mind here that I'm using this test kernel, okay? And I have another kernels like R kernel, Python 3, and Torch kernel. So I'll use test kernel. Now this is important because we will see in which kernel we will install our packages. So there are two methods to install packages. First is using exclamation pip and the another one is using instead of exclamation percentage. And what is the difference? It's all about the kernels, right? So first, if I install exclamation pip install tensorflow. Okay, as an example, we are installing tensorflow, right? So if I do this with exclamation in front of this, now this will also install this package. Now let me let me try to run this. Now this is running as you can see with the blue denotion here. So let's I'll let this finish and then I'll show you what happens. Okay, so now this is finished processing and it is saying we already have TensorFlow install and if it was not installed, it will be installed now. If I try to import TensorFlow, let's see what happens. Now it is saying no module named TensorFlow. But we just installed TensorFlow, why is this happening? This is because we used this, that is the exclamation while installing our TensorFlow, right? Now what this exclamation does is, it does not install TensorFlow in this current kernel. It will install TensorFlow in the global or the source Python, that is the first kernel that was being shown, that is our Python 3 kernel. Now this is the base kernel, or this is the base Python version. Now this, ex this exclamation will install it in base kernel. Now if you are also happen to using, sorry, <laughs> if you happen to use the base Python version, it will work. But if you are using another kernel, this will not work. Now, if you don't know how to create new kernels, you can check the first link in the description. So, to install TensorFlow in the current kernel that is being used, what you can do is, instead of exclamation, use percentage. So, if I try to run this now, this will install TensorFlow in this kernel. So, a good practice is to always use percentage. So, even if you are in base Python version, it will be installed in base. If you are in another kernel, it will be installed in another kernel. So let's see what happens after this installation is complete. So after a long time, TensorFlow is finally installed in this kernel and let's see if we can import it now. Import tensor. So I hope this works. So it is taking a longer time this time. This means that TensorFlow is actually importing. So as you can see here, there is no error. This means that TensorFlow is installed. So these were the two methods of how you can install packages in TensorFlow. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.